it's really not for me to assess where, who did it and uh, whether it actually took place, although there is a lot of evidence that it actually did take place. We have a special UN and other organization in the addressing that. But uh, if it did take place, it is a war crime. Mm. And as such, uh, it, uh, it would require everyone, all co-chairs and everyone else, to address it immediately. And I think that the investigation is still taking place, and there are people more competent than you and I to be able to assess that. It is heart-wrenching for thousands of humanitarian workers in and around Syria to not be able, allowed by the fighting and by the parties, to come to the rescue as a lifeline to these millions of people. There are enormous resources ready and humanitarian workers willing to take the risk to go into the, these zones if they get the permission. And they are not at the moment. So today in the meeting, the Russian uh, delegation confirmed their willingness to sit down with us today and tomorrow to try to agree on a workable humanitarian pause for us to go the Aleppo Road way to help the poor people of East as well as in, in the West.